Hi everybody, welcome to my Minecraft tutorial. This is how to install 7-zip so that you can modify your Minecraft.jar file. And that is a requirement essentially if you want to install any of the more popular mods such as Mo Creatures, uh, Baby Animals, NPC Mobs, etc, etc. So first thing we need to do is go ahead and grab 7-zip. It's a free program. So load up your browser, go to 7-zip.org. I've got the website up running right here. Now this is only going to work for Windows. I'm using Windows 7 here, but it will work on XP and Vista. If you have a Mac, you will have to find another way to do it, because I don't do it on a Mac. Anyway, so uh, the next step is once you're at this web page, you'll see two downloads. We've got a 32-bit version and a 64-bit version, so we need to determine what your Windows is. So go ahead and Roll down here, click on your start button, go to the control panel, open that up. And again, I'm using Windows 7 here. So if you're using XP, it's going to look a little bit differently, but you want to get to your system properties. So click on that, click on system, and you're looking for where it will say the system type 32 bit or 64 bit. Most likely, if you're on XP, 99% of the time you're a 32-bit system but verify anyway just in case if it's a Vista or Windows 7 it could be one way or the other but you have to get in here and figure that out as you can see here I'm using a 32-bit so that makes it very clear for me which download I need to grab and that's the 32-bit So I'm gonna go ahead and click on download and Chrome pops up a little window here and it's going to download this executable file. Click on save. It's a small file, it shouldn't take very long. And then run that executable file. If you have user account control enabled, you'll get this little pop-up. Just wants to confirm that you trust this source and you say, yep, yeah, it's okay. And then you're going to go ahead and give it a destination folder. By default, it's going to be C program files 7-zip. Now, I've already got 7-zip installed, so I'm just going to choose E. I have another data drive, and that's called E, and I'm going to hit install. I'm just going to install this right over my current installation. And that's it. It only takes a minute. Click finish, and 7-zip is installed. So now let's head over to your Minecraft folder and open up the .jar file. Now in order to do this, you'll have to follow along. Again, if you're on XP, it might look a little bit differently. But you want to get to your run box, this little text box down here, where on Windows XP it says run. It may be over in this area. But on Vista and 7, it's this little search bar, and you're just going to type in the percent symbol and then a p p d a t a percent so it's app data percent and then hit enter and it will open up your app data folder and right here at the very top you'll see dot minecraft double click on that and open it up and then you'll see bin folder double click on that and open up the bin folder and here you should see a file called minecraft.jar if you have extensions showing, it'll say .jar. If you don't see the .jar, it's just going to say Minecraft. You can go over here, go to Organize, Folder and Search Options, click on the View tab, and as you can see here, I have Show Hidden Files, Folders and Drives. Oops, I'm sorry, that's not the right one. Um, hide Extensions for Known File Types. If this is checked, and it is by default on most computers, that .jar disappears. I like to see those so I keep them showing at all times. Now if, again if you're on XP to get that to show it's going to be over here in a, a, a menu called tools and you're going to drop down the tools menu and it will say f uh, folder options or something like that. Um, not that it matters it's only going to be one file in here called Minecraft and now we just want to open it up with 7-zip. So go ahead and right click on that Minecraft folder uh, file and you will see on your little menu here a new option that says 7-zip so point to that and then it opens up another little sub menu 
and you'll have over here on this side a whole bunch of different options and we really just want the first one open archive and now 7-zip opens up in the file manager program and it shows you the contents of the .jar file and this is it this is all code .jar is a java file and this is basically all the code that tells Minecraft what to do now you have to manipulate this file when you install mods for example mo creatures and I'm going I already have a tutorial for that um, you will be able to open up the uh, mo creatures downloaded file a zip file and then just drag and drop them right in here and then your Minecraft will have whatever that mod happens to be so that's pretty much it that's how you open up the jar file now again this tutorial isn't going to get into installing the various mods this is just for you to install 7-zip and show you how to open up the jar file so that's pretty much it I hope this helped have a good day bye bye